Joining us now, Selena Drexel and her husband, Dr. Todd Drexel, from their home in Bowling Green, Kentucky. Thank you very much for getting up and being with us this morning. I know it's very important for you to talk about this. And could you just give us a little more background, Selena? I know you also have a, a nine-year-old, Grace, a two-year-old, Caroline. They were with yes. you, too. So walk us through what happened, Selena. Uh, we were leaving uh, New Orleans from a family vacation, and uh, when we proceeded to go through the security line, um, we were selected to go through the, the new screening procedures. Um, Anna was, was picked to go through. Pretty much everybody except the baby was, was picked to go through uh, the, the scanner. And for some reason, Anna was selected for a pat-down. I can only speculate as to why I didn't get a lot of information. Although I did ask questions as to why uh, she was being selected for pat-down, um, I, I didn't really get a lot of information. I did ask for alternatives. I asked for her to be mm -hmm. rescanned mm -hmm. and was refused. Um, but they didn't and give I, you I any... chose to videotape it because, mm -hmm. no, they, oh. they just refused and said they were going to do what they were going to do. And um, not verbally, but in, in no uncertain terms, apparently the TSA supervisor is very skilled at nonverbal communication letting me know that there would be trouble if I, if I caused a, a fuss. But nothing was so said because we heard that we, did we, we saw the TSA agent that was patting down your daughter uh, was, was being as gentle as, as, as possible, I, but absolutely can agent, understand. That agent was, was acting, that agent was doing what she was right. instructed to do. Todd, what was, what was, was your girl's... agent off camera. Thank you. What, what was, your, uh, was Anna's reaction um, as this was happening and afterwards? Well, I think initially she was just confused, but she's a very respectful adult. So yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Did yeah. what she was asked to do. And afterward, um, she broke down with crying because she really didn't understand what she'd done wrong. And so we were really struggling with how do we explain this because we really stressed her. You know, it's not okay to touch, be touched here in these certain places. And now she's been pat down in a, in a public setting in an airport and. She was upset and crying, so we had to try to explain this to her. It was very difficult. I'm sure it was very confusing to her. And yes, we could hear her. She's so well-mannered, and we could hear her saying, yes, ma'am, uh, to the agent. Uh, there's a lot of questions as to why you decided to post this on YouTube for others to see, and what is your hope will come of this, Selena? Well, our, my, my reason for posting it was that we, we just had a, a very bad feeling that, that you know, what happened was, was wrong, and I posted it out there to, to get other people's opinions on it and to see, you know, to get, to get some other people's thoughts on it. Um, we felt that it was inappropriate. You know, we struggled to teach our, our child to protect themselves, to say no, to say, it's, you know, it's not okay for, for folks to touch me in this way, in these mm -hmm. areas. Uh, yeah, here we are, you know, saying, okay, well, it's okay for these people. We feel that for children especially, the answer should always be no. Um, that there needs to be different screening procedures, especially for children. And if we don't find other ways, we're then making them mo more vulnerable to, um, to people that would harm them in that manner. Well, you both bring up some excellent points, and, and we know the TSA does uh, the best job that they can, and a, a lot of people know that because of the world we live in right now, and uh, very difficult circumstances, and they too have said they need to review their policy. So thank you very much for bringing this to light, and we hope that Anna and your other two little girls are doing all right. Thank you both. Thank yes, you. Thank good you. Morning. Good morning. Uh, have a good day.